Last year, you have heard from us as we shared our very own stories. And now we want to hear from you. So we're debuting a new segment called Your Very Own Stories. Andy, you've been tasked with this assignment of sharing LA stories. Yes, it is very exciting. I am uh, so happy to be here. So excited about the new segment. So we're going to start with Kara. Uh, a creative way to sell sandwiches during the pandemic turned into a viral sensation. And three years later, she has a big announcement to make. Do you cheers? Do you cheers sandwiches? Yeah, we should cheers. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I'm Kara, AKA Calabama, and this is my very own story. Heads up in East Hollywood. You. you might catch a flying sandwich. This has been the most unique, amazing experience I've ever created and had for myself. And I always think if I never did anything else, this would be the coolest thing ever. This is Calabama. Her apartment is here, and this fire escape is where she serves breakfast. Ooh, it's gorgeous. I live in California. I'm from Alabama, and my name is Kara with a C, so Alabama. Kara had the idea when the pandemic hit as a way to safely get food to customers. I was doing the breakfast sandwich and the hot sauce before the pandemic um, at different coffee shops around town. And I was inspired by my friend who lives in Brooklyn, and he was throwing burgers down a slide of that inspired me to come up with a bucket drop. Of course, it took off on social. Thanks for this love and support. For three years, people have shown up every Sunday to be blessed from above. The Calabama team slings as many as 80 breakfast sandwiches every week made right in Kara's kitchen. It's hard to forget the sight of your next meal flying down a fire escape, but let me tell you, the breakfast sandwich here is no gimmick. I even gotta get one more dip. Oh my God. Really good. What is happening with that sauce? No, the sauce is the thing. And the onion. I use one slice of American and one slice of cheddar. Soft scramble all the way, undercooked, and then throw it on the sandwich so it finishes cooking on the sandwich. But all good things, as they say, must come to an end. I'm gonna say this without trying to cry. I have to end the bucket drop because of like logistical stuff, the fact that the building is no longer having it. And even though my neighbors have been awesome, I just wanna control the narrative and shut it down before it gets shut down for me. What will you do now? I think now I've gotta go back to what Calabama originally was, which is hot sauce and sandwiches. And I'll still find a way to deliver the sandwiches, whether that's, you know, a ghost kitchen, a brick and mortar. And so this Sunday is the very last drop. It probably, knowing myself, it probably won't sink in until later after it's over and then I'll have a private breakdown. <laughs> I didn't think I'd make it. Now, if you wanna support Calabama for her final drop on Sunday, you can check her out on the link on her Instagram, that's at Calabama. Uh, best of luck to her. The thing is that these sell out super quick, so they might already be sold out, but the final drop is Sunday, March 26th at Calabama, um, and really honored that she was, uh, she let us do uh, her for the first story. And we would like to hear your very own story. So if you or somebody you'd like to nominate has an interesting story, you can contact me at AndyKTLA on Instagram. We're looking for anybody and everybody, all over SoCal, not just food or music like I've done a lot of packages about, but anything, anybody who has an interesting story, we'd really love to share that. So uh, that's, our, that's our new segment. Any Thanks, others guys. you're working on? Not that I can talk about yet, oh. but yes, I am. We have a lot in the can. We're going to start seeing them over the next couple of weeks. I think every Tuesday, if you guys will have me back, um, we'll, uh, we'll do them here. I on think the I sent show. you a text message. I said, get Cal can like hook me up with a sandwich. I couldn't even get a sandwich. You know what I'm saying? Like I was looking forward to it. Uh, just best of luck to her yeah. just watching her story because I, you know, to be so creative, I think that was one of the best things of the pandemic because people got real creative yeah. how they were going to, you know, still maintain a business. And I'm happy she had a, clearly a successful business. Yeah, it's really cool. And it feels very L.A. also, yeah. you know, it's cool East Hollywood dropping a bucket down a fire escape. So uh, neat that we had that while we had it for sure. Yeah. yeah, at Andy KTLA on Instagram if you want to nominate somebody. That is correct, yes. Cool. Could be you. Nominate yourself. Why not? <laughs> no shame. If you think you're interesting, go ahead. You are. You are LA. You're definitely interesting enough. <laughs> Thanks, Andy. Yeah, good to see you guys. Yeah. Coming up, another star-studded event at the White House today. From Legend